My name is Nadine Sangwa. I'm from Rwanda. My name is Akot Philip from South Sudan. My name is Judy Wanjiru and I'm from Kenya. My name is Kenga Jiloa Alinda. I'm a Uganda. When I first coded, it was it was really, really interesting because I actually first went back to check what did I just do. <laughs> I, I, I didn't imagine that I could actually do something and see it be executed immediately. Like I was now curious to know the power of what I've just done. Yeah. I felt so good. Uh, I don't think I'll ever forget that day. Uh, I, I have always been afraid of tech and my first line of code I was like so I can do this this is all <laughs> yeah I actually thought that tech is only for the guys but getting an, an opportunity to come to Akira Chicks where we were all females uh, I believe that it's not only for them we can also do it I thought it was all about mathematics um, or maybe cleaning laptops connecting them yeah that's what i thought about tech the first day that i reached here at akira chicks i was like is this the school because back then i've never been in like a place like this the environment the rooms they were so nice and uh, also the people that i met i met people from different communities and also countries and i was so amazed by how the environment and the people are my first impression was that uh, it was a big place, like a big home, it was uh, and so peaceful. What I would really miss more is the friends that I've got because they have been like a family to me right now. I'll miss cultural days, yeah. <laughs> I'll miss that a lot because I got to learn different things from different cultures and it's a day that was Everyone likes that day, I think. So I'll miss, um, I'll miss learning each and every day because each and every day we are challenged to learn something new. So um, waking up to know that today I'm going to learn something new, something great. And by the end of the day, I know that I'm going to do something I've never done before. I'll miss that and I'll keep it. I'll keep going on with it. <laughs> yeah. If I was to turn back time, I'd apply to Akira Chicks because this was like the best move and the best decision I ever made like on my own basically because uh, I have learned how to code in different languages I'm not going to have a job in tech something I never thought I'd like I'd fit in and now I um, it's it's possible Accra Chicks was it's a life-changing experience I've never thought I would be I will get an opportunity to experience this I've grown, I've got a career, I've met people with different minds. I can see the world in a different perspective. When I look at myself like in January and I look at myself right now, I'm very different. At first I could not stand in front of people and be able to, like, to present or talk to many people, but currently I can stand even in front of a hundred people and be able to communicate. I can now call myself a software developer, a UI UX designer, like I have full control over my future and I get to choose where I want to go, which career path I want to take. So Akira Chicks has given me that, so I definitely still apply, yeah.